All right, hello everyone. Uh, I'm gonna shoot a video today showing all of my still books. Uh, I've been wanting to do this video for some time and I've never had time. And my room's kind of a mess because uh, I've got some stuff for Christmas that I haven't put away and even Black Friday stuff isn't put away. But anyway, my movies are sorted by genre and then by alpha. So we'll start with the, uh, you know, the action I think is what I have first in my genre section over here. So we'll start with that work our way through and get to family. And then over here, we have the superhero section. And then I've got some that I've just gotten that I'll have to show. And then over here, I've got my Star Wars still books. So, uh, you know, as far as my room goes, it's I'm out of room and I don't, that's why I haven't put this stuff away and why my table's so cluttered. I don't know where to put them. So it's a problem that I have to deal with. So, but that's another video and another day. So let's get into the uh, still books. And let's just get over here to the shelf here. And I'm just going to sit down here and then, you know, shine it up. So we have, first off, Alien Covenant. I just pulled these out and, uh, you know, I'm going to slide them back in as I go. Uh, Baby Driver. Uh, back to the Future Trilogy. Then we have uh, Clash of the Titans. Wrath of the Titans. Close Encounters of the Third Kind. Deepwater Horizon, uh, Elysium, Escape from New York, The Fate of the Furious, G.I. Joe Retaliation, Hercules, Independence Day, Independence Day Resurrection, Jumanji, King Kong, the Matrix, keep going down, Super 8, uh, more of a metal pack, uh, Taken Trilogy, Total Recall, the remake, uh, Transformers, oh, that, that was Revenge of the Fallen by the way, not the first one, uh, Age of Extinction, Triple uh, X, The Return of Xander Cage, down here, we've got Tom Cruise, The Edge of Tomorrow. Tom Cruise in uh, Mission Impossible Rogue Nation. Tom Cruise's Oblivion. War of the Worlds with Tom Cruise. And the Top Gun 30th Anniversary. Now we're going to go up top here. Uh, back up top, we got Creed. And I just dropped a Funko Pop. Get that picked up. Uh, then we've got Stallone's First Blood. Uh, then we've got Schwarzenegger, Double Feature, Total Recall, Terminator 2. Then we've got Arnold's Commando. And I don't want to knock off the stuff I have on top, obviously. Uh, it's kind of hard to get these in and out with stuff sitting on them. Uh, then we have Arnold in Predator. Then I have two Total Recall steelbooks, which I'm going to have to struggle to get out of here. Uh, you can see here, that's the Mondo. Really nice steel book there. And then we have the uh, one that was out at Best Buy, Total Recall. The artwork's fantastic on that. Okay, now let's try to get these back up. Sorry about having to zoom in and everything. Then we've got Terminator 2. This is uh, what I got from Best Buy. I don't know when it came out. Uh, and then we have the Terminator 2, Judgment Day. You'll find that I'm into Terminator 2 steelbooks big time, or Terminator franchise steelbooks as they go all the way down that line. I'm going to do those in a separate video. I'm just going to do an overview on them on this one. So let's just go ahead and do those. You can see there, there's Terminator, Terminator 2. Uh, on the video where I go over them, I'll say what they are and where I got them, how much I paid and all that. But you can see here that I've got uh, multiple Terminator, Terminator 2 steelbooks. And a lot of these are very expensive and, and hard to find and out of print today. Then I've got two down here, the, the Mondo Terminator 2 still books. One's red and one's green. So uh, I've got Genesis, Salvation, Terminator 3, all of them. You know, I think I've got like over 20 Terminator still books in my collection. So that is another video that I'll do later. So let's just continue on with this one. And... We'll get back into the second Blu-ray shelf. Uh, we have Jean-Claude Van Damme Street Fighter, uh, Universal Soldier, and coming on down, we have the Ghostbusters, 
and we have Ghostbusters 2, and then we have the Ghostbusters remake, which is a horrible movie. Then we have Halloween, the remake, and let's keep going here. Resident Evil, Degeneration, Resident Evil, Resident Evil Apocalypse, Resident Evil Extinction, Resident Evil Afterlife, Resident Evil Res Retribution, and Resident Evil The Final Chapter. Here's the Sharknado collection, embossing on that too, it's really nice. Uh, and then we're going to keep going down, we're going to go with the E.T. Anniversary Steel Book. Uh, I don't remember, if, is that the 25th? I can't remember. Uh, Ghost in the Shell, Passenger 57, Passengers, I'll start to say Passenger 57, Passengers, Serenity, Star Trek Into Darkness, Star Trek Beyond, Starship Troopers, and down here on the bottom we have Whiplash, and now we're getting into the comedies, uh, we got the Blues Brothers, Steelbook, and we got Edward Scissorhands, 25th anniversary, and let's keep going up, and keep scanning here, we got Scott Pilgrim versus the World, uh, Super Bad, whoops, Almost dropped it. Then we've got Ted 2. Now we're getting into the family Disney section. Not many of those. We got the Cinderella still book. Then we have the Lion King. Sorry about the shade. We've got Beauty and the Beast, the live action. And down here we've got the Disney's Pirates of the Caribbean, Dead Men Telling the Tales still book. And down here on the very bottom, I'll pull it out so we can see it. Rad still book. Really like the movie Rad. And then these are kind of hard to get to, so let me try to work my way here. Space Jam. And we've got Wizard of Oz still book. I love the way that looks. And then we we'll keep coming down to some Christmas still books. We've got A Christmas Story, uh, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation, The Classic Elf, Home Alone still book. Wish I had a Home Alone 2 still book. They put out a combo. Uh, it's a Wonderful Life still book. Really like that still book. And of course, the Polar Express. All right, so now we're going to come over here to the Star Wars section. And let me move these two figures. Uh, I'm not going to be able to show these too well unless I get them off the shelf. Uh, Star Wars A New Hope. Star Wars The Empire Strikes Back. Uh, Star Wars Return of the Jedi. These look good. A poster right on the back. Then we've got uh, Star Wars The Phantom Menace. Uh, Star Wars The Attack of the Clones. Uh, Star Wars Revenge of the Sith. Star Wars The Force Awakens. And Star Wars uh, The Last Jedi. And let me must not forget Star Wars Rogue One. Let me fix these back here. Put these back up. I need to dust, I know. It's hard to keep a room dusted whenever you're uh, as busy as I am. Uh, let's see here. We'll get the ones that I haven't shelved last. But let's start out here in the superhero section. Uh, we've got Batman. Batman Returns. Batman Begins. The Dark Knight. The Dark Knight. Dark Knight Rises, uh, Batman vs. Superman, and you know, more animated ones, Batman vs. Robin, Batman Assault on Arkham, Batman Black Bad Blood, Batman The Killing Joke, Batman Return of the Cape Crusaders, Batman vs. Two-Faced, I think that was Adam West's last appearance, uh, Batman vs. Harley Quinn, and Harley Quinn. Uh, then we've got the Avengers Age of Ultron, uh, Captain America Civil War, the Mondo Steelbook Dread, Fantastic Four, I like that one, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy Vol. 2, the Justice League Steelbook, the Kick-Ass Steelbook, very nice, and then we've got the Spider-Man 2 Steelbook exclusive from Best Buy, I think this thing's very expensive, 
thought I saw it on eBay for like 200 bucks, but I'm not sure if it's still that. Uh, then we've got Spider-Man Homecoming, uh, Power Rangers, The Suicide Squad, Superman Returns, The Man of Steel 3D, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Out of the Shadows. And then we have Venom. Venom, uh, Let There Be Carnage. I love the Venom movies. Uh, Wonder Woman. And then we're going to go Justice League, The New Frontier. Justice League, Throne of Atlantis. Justice League versus the Teen Titans. Justice League Dark. Teen Titans, The Judas Contract. And the Wonder Woman animated movie on Steelbook. So now, let's keep moving. I'll show the ones I haven't put on the shelf yet. Got this at Walmart, uh, Clueless. Uh, Last Action Hero ordered on sale from Amazon. I think it was $17.99. Picked up the Maverick, uh, Top Gun Maverick steelbook from Target. Then I've got the Fast and the Furious uh, steelbook in the collector's pack. And then here is the Hunger Games Ultimate Collection. I got this for $60 bucks on sale at Best Buy. Uh, all four movies, matching steelbooks are amazing. Really like that set. And last but not least, while I'm at it, uh, got a couple of steel books over here. We've got uh, their DVD steel books G.I. Joe, uh, Rise of the Cobra. And let me see if I can't get it back in. And uh, where's the other one? Die, live Free or Die Hard. First steel book I ever bought. Uh, didn't even realize that it was a steel book. I was just buying it. So that completes my steel book collection video. I'm uh, glad I got to do that. Uh, like I said, where I'm lacking is on the Terminator still books. I've got over 20, but I want to go into more detail on those. So that vid will be coming. So uh, until my next video, I'll be back.